Hello again, YouTube Truth Man here. So I told y'all that I had a new character that I'm gonna add, and he's gonna be making guest appearances on this channel, and that's Fairy Tale Felix. Fairy Tale Felix believes that he's he's a believe all women guy, and like I said, he's gonna make his appearance real soon uh, but I'm appearing on his behalf and I'm gonna show you today four things four of the delusional things that he believes and fairy tale Felix is everywhere man you know he has his spirit lives in many men uh, we see him on YouTube sometimes uh, we just saw I don't know the guy's real name, but he had on a Chicago White Sox hat. So he's probably from Chicago somewhere. Uh, he He's a fairy tale Felix guy. You know, he has the spirit of fairy tale Felix. And he said that a woman has to say that you're a man. And Dr. BOA uh, put this fairy tale Felix on one of his recent masterpiece videos and uh just kind of reacted to fairy the fairy tale felix man just understand that fairy tale felix has many disciples all over the world man it could be some of y'all co-workers so you gotta watch what you saying because fairy tale felix will turn against you man and he'll he'll do a lot of different things to try to bring you down if you don't agree with him. Uh, he's in the church, you know, he he says that you're bitter and hurt when you talk about such things as we talk about in this space. And even will go as far to question whether or not you saved when you don't cater to women like he does. He'll believe that you're on your way to hell. I tell y'all all the time to be careful with these church guys and these church women. Yes, yes, there are some that's genuine. There are some whose name really is in the book of life, but there are a whole lot more that's not. They're in marriages. They come on our stuff with no face, Criticizing what we talk about in this space. They will side with your wife, even though she is passive aggressive, critical, highly critical, a nag, acting evil in many different ways. And then she, like Fairy Tale Felix, because she'll end up with a Fairy Tale Felix, will play gospel music. <clears throat> after evil behavior going totally against first peter chapter three that tells her to let her win her husband if he not right paraphrasing with her own lifestyle and behavior she won't what she'll do is she will continue to get on a man's nerve until he just says you know what it's not worth it. And then she gets with fairy tale Felix. I see what you're talking about. That ain't him, you, that's him. You often end up KOing these fairy tale Felixes. A lot of dudes end up with restraining orders on them because of these fairy tale Felixes. That's why I say beware. A fairy tale Felix. And that's what we're going to call this one. Beware of fairy tale Felix for of his delusional ideas. Let's go. Number one, you ain't laying the pipe right. Somehow, for some reason, fairy tale Felix thinks that he's more endowed than you. He thinks that he lays the pipe better than you. But, 
in a lot of cases, the woman you divorced wasn't giving you a chance to lay the pipe. Let's go here. Some of them will literally keep you out of their vag so it won't be loose for the next man, whether it be Pookie, Ray Ray, Fairtail Felix. This is why he has this delusional notion. Because Fairytale Felix often ends up with women who have not been having sex. And let's be honest, sometimes they do tighten back up over time. I mean, after all, if they go two, three years without it, and they don't have no DIL dose. It's possible, you know. Fairy tale Felix, she'll tell him that he laid the pipe better than you. She's lying. A lot of times they be lying. And she will try to fleece you for money to buy gifts for Fairy Tale Felix on his birthday. Y'all gotta get to know Fairy Tale Felix, and you will. I'm going to make sure of it because I'm going I'm to invite him to the show. He might not show you his face. You know, when Fairytale Felix makes his appearance, it's often a faceless icon with a letter talking slick because he don't want you to see who he really is. You know? So like I said, number one, you ain't laying the pipe right. Number two, you're broke. Often another thing that happened with Fairy Tale Felix is she'll actually go to work and try to help him. But with you, you had it all on your own neck. And you're broke. You're broke. She's so blessed, but you were broke while you was with her. You you had plenty of money before, but fairy tale Felix is say he just wasn't handling his business. You know sometimes fairy tale Felix be having money because you know they play it safe. They don't really chase their dreams. You know. Number three, you don't know how to lead women, sir. It ain't them, it's you. See, even though some of them had high body comes before you got to them, and even though some of them were never taught how to be a wife, and even though, even though nobody ever really corrected them on their actions, because a lot of these women in fairy tale. Felix ends up with they try to keep all the business privacy because see keeping the business private allows them to remain evil nobody's confronting them nobody's disagreeing with them it's just them pulling a piece of skin off of you every day and then they end up with fairy tale Felix Number four, last but not least. They know how to treat women better than you. I mean, even though some of these guys have been married two, three times. I mean, even though these guys be having three folk kids <clears throat> out of wedlock. I mean, even though they're a little punk. On their job, they never stand up for themselves. They somehow know how to treat women better than you and me. I got smoke for Fairy Tale Felix, but you know what, man? We're going to allow him to explain <clears throat> to y'all in the future some of his philosophies I mean we 
Hey, he, hey, listen. It's quite comical, man. Just, just be on the lookout for him. That's why y'all got to turn on y'all notification bells. So when he comes on the show, you will be there to see him. You gonna learn, y'all gonna learn a lot because Fairytale Phoenix is a combination of pander, pander bear, preacher. He say, well, I ain't been, I ain't officially, I, I don't officially have my own church, but I make appearances on Facebook and other aspects of social media. So y'all done heard him, you know, but he's, he's, he'll be here soon. Anyway, we got more videos to, to do. So stay tuned. This is the truth, man. The channel is the no matrix, no simp and all subjects channel.